Welcome and congratulations to the winners of this brand competition, men. First position, Emil Hegel Svensson, Norway. Second position, Ole Einer Björndalen, Norway. And third position, Martin Foucault, France. Emil, first win this season. Was it a surprise or did you know that you are now in the form needed for this? Uh, it's not a surprise, but uh, but uh, for sure it's it's a good confirmation to have. And uh, it's always <laughs> you're always a bit anxious before you get the first win and the first really good confirmation of uh, of your shape. And um, so this was uh, this was a great thing before uh, before the Olympics to have uh, at least one win. And uh, it feels good to be to be back on the top. Was it good to skip World Cup three? Was it a part of the success today? Maybe. Uh, it's not a part of the success today, but it's part of uh, a bigger plan towards the Olympics. So uh, today was uh, just, I guess, uh, confirmation of good work and hard work. So uh, now we're looking forward to the Olympics and uh, try to um, just try to build uh, an, an even better shape for for the Olympics. What can you tell us about the conditions today? It looked horrible on TV. Uh, how was the course? Uh, the course was uh, extremely good. It was uh, uh, solid uh, all the way. Um, good snow. I think pretty fair conditions for all the athletes, actually, uh, even though it was so warm and uh, and raining a lot. So it was, uh, the conditions were great. On the shooting range, it's a bit different <laughs> with, the, with the fog and the wind uh, coming and going a little bit. So, so very demanding conditions, if you can say that, uh, on the shooting range. And uh, your technicians managed very well with this different kind of snow, artificial and brought in snow. Yeah, I think we had the uh, me and Ola. We are also on the same ski brand, and <coughs> I think we had very good equipment today. So, uh, so this was this was um, this was uh, this was good to see. Because I think maybe in the Olympics we can see many of the same, a lot of the same conditions. So it was good uh, confirmation also on that part. Ola Einer, being so close to another win, are you happy or sad about the second position today? First moment, I was for sure sad, but uh, when I saw that it was Emil, was for me absolutely not a problem, because uh, most important to have the victory in Norway. Uh, so I was really happy with my race. Uh, it was really, really good, and good skiing, good shape, and shooting was okay. Uh, it was difficult on prone shooting, standing was... Uh, uh, I had a good condition, so yeah, I was really happy with my race today. You were not in problems with standing shooting with the wind? Uh, no, I doesn't have so much wind on the standing. That was my mistake. <laughs> okay. Mata, again on the podium, are you satisfied or concerned about Emil's performance today now? Mm, I you know uh, Emil and uh, Ole did well, and I uh, have just to congrats them. I'm just uh, disappointed of my uh, standing shooting. You can never be satisfied with uh, three mistakes on uh, on standing, but yeah, my my shape is uh, is good, and uh, I'm happy to be on on the battle with them. And uh, you know, I uh, be on the podium with uh, Emil and uh, Ole is uh, always a good performance. So yeah, I'm I'm really happy. But uh, today, uh, uh, Norway took the lead on uh, the number of uh, victory this season. Uh, Norway four, Martin three. So <laughs> I have to uh, to uh, to be a better on the pursuit to try to to keep the to keep the first place. Is it mentally hard to uh, change from these great conditions we had in Le Grand Bonnard with beautiful weather and all that stuff to these conditions here? <clears throat> yeah, you no. Know, you know, at home we had also some uh, good condition, but also some days really horrible. So. I was really, um, you know, not happy to come in Oberhof when I saw the conditions. But today, the, like uh, said Emil, the course was uh, just perfect. You know, uh, I took a lot of pleasure on the track. I felt uh, strong, and yeah, uh, the organization did a really amazing job with uh, the horrible snow conditions they had. So yeah, we we have just to thank them to organize a, a, a good competition with this kind of conditions. Do we have questions? No. Thank you very much.